Okay, question number 11. We had a little bit of a sneak preview of it before. It says n is an integer, which means n is a whole number. Write down all the following possible values of n. Well, it's not allowed to be because this is a strict inequality, it doesn't have an extra line here. I'm not allowed to take minus 2. I would be allowed minus 1.9 or 1 minus 1.99, etc., minus 1.5, because it's an integer, I'm allowed the whole numbers. So I'm allowed nor minus 1, nor 1, 2, and I'm allowed 3 because this here is a strict, um, is, is a loose inequality, so I'm allowed to have the number 3 as well. Straightforward. Second part. It says x is a number, another number is 9 greater than x, both numbers are whole numbers, the total of the two is less than 60. Find the greatest possible value. Well, x is a number, when we add it onto the other number, which is x plus 9, because it's 9 greater, we know it's strictly less than 60. So when I sort all this out, 2x plus 9 is less than 60, rearranging my inequality, 2x is less than 51, so x must be less than 25.5. We'll just go back to here. It says both numbers are whole numbers, they're integers. So x is going to be less than this, so the first integer that's less than that is the number 25.